Hey guys, what's up? This is Millie here. Now from time to time we all like to, you know, go to the movies and watch a great flick, be it a Bollywood movie or a Hollywood movie. But sometimes, just sometimes, directors, actors, producers and the other people involved tend to get involved in some atrociously absurd movies. So I've made a list of a whole bunch of Bollywood movies that make absolutely no sense to me whatsoever. Literally, these movies have made me lose faith in entertainment and makes me wonder what the future of Bollywood is. Lego. Number one, Joker. Now this movie is about Akshay Kumar, well let's just make the long story short to save you from the pain and torture that I had to endure. This movie is about Akshay Kumar uh, who works as a scientist in the States, I'm guessing NASA, I can't remember exactly, comes all the way back to his village in India because his ailing father wants to see him one last time. But when he comes, he finds out his father isn't ill at all. It's just the entire village need needs dire help in getting access to resources that they need to survive. And their brilliant plan in getting media attention and government attention is to dress up as aliens. Let's just take a minute to lose faith in entertainment all over again. Such creativity! Who would have thought that dressing up as aliens would get government attention, would get media attention, would help them overcome the problems they are now suffering and actually get results? It doesn't end there though. Um, Akshay Kumar's friend, played by Shreya Stalpade, he there was some sort of issue with him and he tends to speak this whole entire different language which is explained at the end of the movie when an actual alien actually comes to earth in India in that village. It happens to be the language of the aliens so Shreya Stalpade and that alien can speak in the same language and understand each other. Wow! Nice thinking out of the box, Shiri Shkunder. Okay, next movie. Love Story 2050. This movie marked the debut of Hrithik Roshan's doppelganger, Harman Baveja. And as all movies go, well, all Bollywood movies go, guy meets girl, girl meets guy. They fall in love, get engaged, girl dies before the wedding, guy is shattered. Um, and the solution to being happy again was that the guy's uncle had built a time machine which the girl had tested and sent herself to the future in the year 2050 and so the uncle suggests to the guy that you can go into the future to see if she's still present present in the future does that make sense to you anyway that's basically the movie and when he does go into the future she is this superstar thing with the talking teddy bear. Don't ask. Yeah, don't ask. And guy meets girl again and they come back. Well, the guy reminds the girl of their past and then they come back to the past and or present and then they get married. Did that entire thing make any sense to you? Moral of that story? Well, I'm not sure what the moral of that story is, sorry. But anyway, Bollywood, please stop investing in sci-fi movies because every time you invest in a sci-fi movie, it just goes down south. I know this list could go on and on, but I'm just going to talk about the last movie, which is Kambak Ishq. Akshay meets Karina. Wait, sorry, I take that back. Akshay hates Karina. Karina hates Akshay. But their best friends are married to each other, whereas they are absolutely against relationships and marriage and etc. My question to you is, well to Bollywood is, do 
Do you not realize that doctors and nurses and whoever else in an operation theater are not allowed to wear jewelry? Because I'm really confused now. you think are absolutely absurd that you have unfortunately had to endure in the comments below i make videos every monday and wednesday so please subscribe to my channel um my social media links are in the description below in case you want to follow me and i will see you guys next time